I'm Pete Tyson. I've run for city commission a number of times, getting a higher percentage of votes each time. I decided to run for city commission when, by a single vote, the city commissioners showed me that they hadn't a clue. They repealed an ordinance the police were using to fight the street drug trade. The police were using the law to fight drugs, and then the city commission repealed it. This pattern of, what can you call it, continues to this day. A few months ago, they passed up a cash now offer of $3 million for some prime real estate on a, a busy corner to get a revocable promise of half that. And not only half that, but half that someday, maybe. The mayor did say she trusted the lowballers. Now, the city is broke. You pass up three million. Okay, well, now let's not even mention the scandals and the infighting. Well, let's not mention that. But we can't arrange a regular inspection for burned out street lights. We can't fund the police pensions, and yet we buy all the latest trendy government toys. I will not vote to give away money for nothing to out-of-town vendors. I will be the commissioner with the work ethic to do my homework. I will be the commissioner who is not influenced by re-election campaign funding issues. I will insist that our public documents are proofread before they are published. I will vote no on every stupid proposal. This is a town where many have said that influence seems to be for sale. How else can it be that proposals that clearly gridlock our roads if not gridlock our lives, are routinely passed five to zero or four to one. Who owns the city? The taxpayers or the five or six out-of-town developers? Well, most of you know me. My website has all my previous speeches and articles. I will hang around afterwards for a little while. Feel free to approach me if you care to. And then there's also my Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. I am Pete Tyson. Vote for me on March 12th. Thank you.